This method can help answer key clinical questions about ultrasound needle tracking, even when the needle is outside the imaging plane. The main advantage of this technique is it helps to eliminate complications and injuries that can arise from poorly tracked needle punctures. Demonstrating the procedure with me will be Sunish Matthews, a research associate at UCL. Begin by selecting a fiber optic ultrasound hydrophone made up of a single mode optical fiber with a Fabry Perot optical cavity at the distal end. Using a scalpel, partially remove the 900 micrometer jacket along the length of the fiber optic hydrophone, close to its distal end, to expose the buffer layer until the hydrophone can fit within the needle cannula. Next, affix a medical needle horizontally to a manual horizontal translation stage and use a stereo microscope to visualize the needle tip with the optical axis of the microscope aligned horizontally and perpendicular to the needle, rotating the needle about its axis as necessary until the bevel can be observed. With the distal end of the needle in view, insert the fiber optic ultrasound receiver through the cannula of a Tuohy Borst sidearm adapter and subsequently through the lure connector of the needle until the sensing region of the hydrophone is just proximal to the bevel surface of the needle. Affix the hydrophone to the translation stage with polyimide tape to avoid movement of the device within the needle. Vertically affix a 20 microliter pipette to the vertical translation stage with the tip facing downward, and use both the horizontal and vertical translation stages to position the micro pipette tip until it is adjacent to the fiber optic hydrophone in about 0.5.